all know Rick, the drummer in Def Leppard, minutes before I got on the air, sent me a video and a song that his wife released today. A very talented uh, singer. Her name is Lauren Monroe. And this recording Rick had sent to me a while ago because the, the person who mixed it, uh, Jim Scott, a friend of mine, actually reps. So he didn't realize I knew him, and we just had this back and forth about it. So today, I'm not saying that in a negative way. I'm just saying it's it's you need a scorecard. Uh, Striper released a brand new song from an upcoming album. Their next album is going to be called Even the Devil Believes, and it's coming out on September 4th, and they've released a single and video today from that forthcoming album called Blood From Above. Striper has gotten progressively heavier with every record. It's amazing. They are, they are, I mean, this is like, you know, again, by Striper standards, they're not a thrash band or certainly not a death metal band, but you know what I'm saying? They're, they get to, they get heavier with every record. So that, you know, Michael Sweet's voice, another ridiculous singer. So check that out. That just hit like hours ago. Some other random things I want to hit you with at the top of the show. I found this interesting. Kerrang! Magazine which is a very, very prestigious magazine, British publication that I grew up with as a kid. When I was, a, when I was much younger, I would dr uh, drive to an import record store just to buy Kerrang! magazine because that was the only place you could get it. And back in the 80s, it was like my Bible. Uh, I haven't, in all honesty, I haven't really kept up with Kerrang! in like the last 20 years because they changed a lot. They ch shifted their focus a little bit to more modern stuff. It's just, it's a little, it's a totally different approach but it's still very important for what it is they did something interesting they did a, a a poll to find out what people thought the greatest metallica song of all time is what do you think ed jump in with a guess oh Great, let's what see. was ranked in kerrang again remember this is a british magazine yeah not that it matters because metallica is a you know, global juggernaut, but well, what do you think the gonna... Kerrang! readers voted the all-time greatest Metallica song? Because it's going to come down to one of either two choices. It's either going to be Enter Sandman or Master of Puppets. Considering it's Kerrang! and they're going for uh, credibility here, going to say Puppets. You got it. Master of Puppets. Ding, ding, what ding. do you think was number two? Oh. And I'll let you in on a death. little secret. It was not, it was not Enter Sandman. <laughs> <sighs> is it off the black album no Ooh, fade to black nope huh from and justice for all one. Oh, okay one no, that makes perfect at number sense. two i didn't see Their the first full music list. video yeah i didn't see the full list but puppets at one one at two according to the readers of kerrang on a poll they did on the greatest Metallica songs ever, which, by the way, is a real interesting sort of uh, yardstick, if you will, because we did say the next Trunk Top 20 will be Metallica. So I found that poll incredibly interesting. I'll look through the whole thing, and then when I eventually get around to doing the Metallica 20, We'll see what the Trunk Nation audience has to say for their 20 greatest Metallica songs. But according to the Brits and the people who read Kerrang, the top two are Puppets and One in that order.